All right, you guys, it is Halloween and it is time for a new video on Max Sound. Again, uh, you know, under the bold leadership of con artist Greg Halpern, the stock has sunk to a new low with a triple zero three. He was reached. Only Greg himself, Huntington Beach, can be proud of this stock price. Let's see how the, the uh, lawsuits are doing here. So, um, again, you know, Greg hasn't responded. He won't respond. We don't want him to, to be honest. And we're looking at a motion being filed very soon. So he, he's been served. Greg has been served. It's over. So Greg has been served in that lawsuit. So Greg is finished in that lawsuit. We are looking for a motion to move, remove him for, you know, for cause. And we expect a hearing for that to happen sometime in December. What's going on with the other shareholder lawsuit? Well, we filed discovery on Greg and, uh, or I'm sorry, Max Sound. He obviously didn't respond. We didn't want him to, so he can no longer object. We have sent him a letter regarding the uh, meet and confer. The next thing we will be doing will be to file a motion to compel him to respond to those answers. Again, we don't expect responses and we don't want them, to be honest because this will kitty corner him into a way he cannot get out of these lawsuits. Now we have two lawsuits, they have different uh, you know, actions that are going on and they have different strategies. So, and they're supposed to. So again, this is what we're supposed to be doing and this is what we are doing. So we will expect Greg to be removed from the company around December, possibly early January if there's any extension on, on these things. but. You know, we don't expect Greg to respond because he's just a, a con artist and a clown and uh, that that would be best for the lawsuits. So as, as far as uh, the main lawsuit, Greg will be removed around, you know, December, January and our lawsuit, we're going to kitty corner him. Same time frame, December, January. Now, there's a lot of, uh, you know, stuff going on on the Yahoo chat boards. And again, you know... <laughs> You know, Connors Greg Huntington Beach has no, you know, way to respond except to make accusations to myself and to uh, Harvey Vitre, the, you know, the person behind the other lawsuit. So, you know, a couple of days ago he called me a sex offender, but of course I live across the street from a school, so you know, in California you, you cannot, as a sex offender live across the street from a school, so it, of course I'm not. But today, <laughs> he claimed I'm a, I'm a pedophile, and he also claimed Harvey Vitry is a pedophile. I mean, he just earned himself some more tabs on that defamation lawsuit. Hey, Greg, let me spell this out to you so the idiots, you know, that you're talking to can hear it. I can sue you for defamation if you say stuff about me that is false and knowingly false. I can say anything about you and I don't, it, and I won't get sued because defamation against you is different. See, you're a CEO of a company. You're a quote, public figure. I'm not. Now I am a media figure, but you're not permitted to openly lie about me. So yeah, when you called me, you know, a pedophile, yes, I am coming after you. And uh, this, again, this is another lawsuit, you know, it would be filed separately, but it is me against you. And yes, I am suing you and Huntington Beach, which is obviously your alias. And by the way, the subpoenas already went out to Yahoo. <laughs> not sure if you're, of course, you're not aware of that because you're just an idiot. But uh, yeah, it, expect things to get really personal.